Hey, what's going on everybody? Engineering Hook Sets here. Uh, today's a bit of a weird video because I'm in a kayak, which I've like never fished out of a kayak before. I'm with Nate F Fishing. This is actually his kayak. Uh, if you guys are watch a lot of Central Illinois videos, uh, you've probably seen his content. He posts a lot of good stuff. I'll link his channel in the description if you wanna go check it out. But yeah, we're here at uh, Weldon Springs State Park today. Pretty cool place. I've only thrown like three casts and I've already caught a bass, so it's shaping up to be a pretty good day. But yeah, I've got a Nico rig right now. We've also got frogs tied on and stuff, but we're just gonna throw everything, give it a shot, see what happens. Maybe we catch bass. He said there's trout in here, which would be cool. I think there's saga in here as well, but yeah, it's gonna be a good time. Uh, do me a favor, if you enjoy the video, consider subscribing, stick around. I think I have a fish on. Third cast. Oh my God, this is so weird. I have like no room. All right, guys, fish. I haven't even done an intro yet. Fish number one. That was my third cast of the day. So much to like keep track of. All right, guys, there's bass number one right there. Not bad. He's probably about a 12 inch or so. Hope the view on that was good. This is the first fish I've caught from a kayak, so I don't know what the camera could see or couldn't see. See you, dude. Dude, I think this thing's already got a bunch of water in it. I'm gonna head to the shore and see if this thing's got like a leaky like plug that's halfway closed or something. Well guys, my kayak made it about uh, 15 minutes before it started to sink. <laughs> so I guess I'm just bank fishing from now on. I think there's a decent sized bass right there. Actually, that might be a channel catfish. I don't think it's a carp. I think it's either a small catfish or a bass. It's kind of hard to tell without that is a catfish, yeah, that's a channel catfish. It's like this big, I know they don't have beds, but it's like on a bed or something right now. It's like, you see where my frog is? Yeah. Directly under that, it's only like eight inches of water. Yeah, that's like right over it. That actually might be a bullhead. It's kind of hard to tell without polarized sunglasses. I wanna go grab my Nico rig, but I don't wanna miss it if you catch him. All right, dude, I got this little uh, finesse worm I wanna try on that thing, if it doesn't bite yours. He's got, he's got it right there. He's you got it. Flathead, dude. Oh, I've never caught a flathead. Yo. Oh. Of it. He got Yo, is that, is that a flathead? Uh, that might be a big bullhead, but I've never caught a bullhead either. Dude, I just freaking sight fished a catfish on a bed. What? Look at that thing, dude. What? <laughs> Look at that guys. Sight fished a catfish on a bed. What? That's so crazy. I think that's like a black bullhead. There you go. Show the side of him. Hell yeah, dude. Guys, is that just a really fat bullhead or is that like a discolored channel? I don't think it's a channel. I think it's a bullhead. Yeah, that's definitely a bullhead. Oh, he's bleeding. I gotta drop him back in. That thing was weird. I didn't know traffic was on bed like that. I didn't either. See ya, dude. Wow. That was insane. That was freaking insane. That's the first bullhead I've ever caught in my life. Really? Sight fished it on a bed. <laughs> cool looking. Yeah, there was actually, there was two down there. The other one was like this big. I think oh. that must be like a, a little male or something. And then that was the big female. I'm pretty sure that's actually a pretty, like a decent one. Yeah, I think bullhead bull pretty small. I don't think it was big, but good job. All right, y'all had to get this one on the third person camera. Fish number three, bass number two. Really healthy fish. Not very thick, but nice colors to them. Once again, we're out here sight fishing catfish and whipping bass on the Nico. Thanks for biting, dude. Ooh, look at these weeds, y'all. That is some good cover right there. I don't know what you guys can see, but just believe me, that looks really good. There's one, finally. Ah, uh, get up here.
Top water. Top water frog. And probably like a pound and a quarter. I'll take it. Number one. Just throwing a top water frog. Got him. Second one on the frog up in here. That's a better one. Dude, that fish was in inches of water. Waited a few seconds after he ate it. Looked pretty good right in the top of the mouth, perfect. That's how you want to pin on the top water frogs. Oh, he's probably about the same size, like maybe a little over a pound. But that's two fish on the frog up in this cut right here. I'll take it. Way up in that cove. <sighs> Got him. Let's go. Five pounds of moss. There we go. Way up there. Probably less than a foot of water. Munched the frog. What a one pounder. See ya. Yeah, that's the third fish going the frog up in some heavy algae bloom mats. Missed it. Come back. Got him that time. He came back for it. Let's go. <laughs> Nothing big, but he came back for it, pitched right back where he missed it, and I hooked him perfectly right in the top of the mouth. Let's go. That one's probably not even a pound. I'll still take it. All right, guys. Well, that's going to do it for today. Uh, yeah, if you like those last two clips, it was from this guy, Native Fishing, so go check out his channel. Yep. Caught four fish today. I got all mine on the frog, and you got all yours on the... Yeah, I got, um, I got all three on the Nico, and then I... That one sight fished uh, bullhead. I think it was a bullhead. Let me let me know if it's not a bullhead because I don't really identify catfish that well. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed the video, uh, do me a favor and then subscribe to both of our channels. We'd really appreciate it. And uh, yeah, I'll see you on the next one.